Yes, you know, it's not every person who's from a family that have criminal inside. You know, fa- criminals, you know, people who indulge in criminal activity are proud of their family members or support them. But you know, the most important thing, they're not denying that they're rel- related to them. So in this bre- groundbreaking video, we delve into the case of our utmost of utmost importance utmost importance centered around national security and safety of an individual closely connected and related to Member of Parliament Angela Brown Burke. For this man's life and his family well being, we have taken preventative measures such as voice masking and selectively deleting specific sensitive information so as not to give away who is the person who is talking. So prepare to hear first and from one of Jamaica's most wanted men, family member, Anthony Brown's family member, who, who's from Warwick Hill, East Kingston. So the shocking revelation confirmed the biological relationship between Member of Parliament Angela Brown Burke and Tony Burke. Tony Brown. So this is something that we have known. Um wow, we have known this more than uh, more than a year or so. Yes, more than a year we know we have, we have known this from this man. So that's why when we'll be telling you that we know that Angela Brown Burke is um, Tony Brown's daughter is because we have the we have the evidence to carb- um, to substantiate seeing to corroborate what we're saying. So moreover, you know, we uncover the truth about Tony Brown's brother, um Desi, that's Desmond Brown. You're going to hear some George up in thing, but not he understand. So during this unfiltered te- you know, testimony, our subject shed lights on the intriguing incident involving a nephew of Tony Brown, referred to as Jackie Fish. It is alleged that Jackie Fish had Box. Yeah man, Box, a member of the PMP LGBTQ plus criminal organization, Danai Williams. And you know, sir, it's not anybody can do that Box Danai Williams and able to leave the same place and he was able to do it because he's Tony Brown's nephew. Yes, so unbelievable. It is claimed that Williams Yeah there you know unbelievable it is claimed that Williams orchestrated an assassination plot against Jackie Fish all while managing to manipulate local police authority namely Donovan Ox O'Connor and Derek Cowboy Knight from Onsby Police Station and other police officer to harass the grieving family during the funeral process, procession of Jackie Fish. So, so add to the gravity of this situation, there are hints that Danai Williams, not only hints, but allegations, and we know for a fact, because um, Luki, yeah, Luki was killing, um, Luki was killed in, at Pegasus. Pegasus, who is from Jungle and Jonestown, know that Pegasus, that is Peter Mitchell, one of Jamaica's number one DJ back in the 80s, yes. And you know Peter Mitchell your brother um squidly ranking and um you understand. So Pegasus that's with down uh, Peter Metro yeah, that's where um yes, I can uh, Ox and Leng, yeah man, and before before the before he was killed, Loki was killed. It was a policeman, you know, from East Kingston, who was a very close friend of Danai Williams, I drop off Loki there, you understand, in in a in, in a jungle and then him, he returned the next day and him thing there with ox and leng them and them thing there. You understand? And them kill and the police them them just out low key and them thing there. When in a preemptive strike save life because him remember the same killer judge and them thing there. And them get all the gun and all them thing there. Everything much here I see that you know one eye gun will kill the judge. You understand? So Yeah and the judge name, you know, and the judge name the track they can de- judge Derek you. So we want to reassure you, our esteemed viewers, that every information you, you receive from us is thoroughly authenticate, authenticated before it is brought to light. We're not going to get everything right sometime, you know. You understand? Some, I just saw it go on them thing, because, you know, it's information, and but we have to make sure you confirm some things. And we had, we had some police officers who used to work at East Kingston, and you're going to hear some, we're going to share some other things, because we are just focused on East Kingston, because... At the death at um, Philip Powell, baby and baby mother. You understand? So as you immerse yourself in this mind-boggling account, remember that knowledge comes with a price. Brace yourself for our eye-opening experience as we unravel Jamaica dark secrets and shed lights on a national security case. Long veil of in secrecy. You can watch 
elevate and decide the truth for yourself. Yeah, man. So you watch, you listen, you decide. So stay tuned for more fascinating updates on our channel. And remember, yeah, man, remember, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, because them say, boy, people, people are telling you, I, I call you, say, Mr. Porter, you need to tell the people them to subscribe and them thing. Yeah, because it's not everybody, because you understand, you have all video where close to 200,000 and you know, I show the thing. So, to remind the people them. So, we are telling you them thing, they say, yeah. Remember, if you haven't subscribed to the channel yet, subscribe. Yeah, man. Like the video. Comment below. Yeah, man. And we respond in due course. You understand? And you know, as you subscribe, be a part of our growing community. Let's unveil the truth together. And, yes. And you know that our we have a Patreon. Patreon. Um, squad yeah because we are all police we are all police and we are all military man so we're rounded you understand internationally and remember you know, we are not ghosts you know you understand what i'm saying we're right here yeah and anyone who wants to talk to me even hey if i'll see it and even want to call you know so we, hey suppose me tell you you know some man call me call call us the other day and tell me say my god me i tell you so between me and you me just laugh and them things so but hey, please, God don't call me back again. You, you understand? Would I like the devil call me? Well, you can't call me back, God. Because this channel is not just... It's the channel of everyone. You understand what I'm saying? This is the people's channel. This is not a church, you know, where we stay upon the pulpit and where we say, you can't... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, man, you can, you, you can add your voice to it and them things. You understand? So, you know, so we'll continue the journey. So I want you to listen to this, man. Because it's going to be a jaw-dropping... Conversation. Yes, welcome to the Jamaica Young Police Channel. To our loyal viewers, subscribers and Patreon members. At the channel, we are a group of law-abiding citizens who believe in the rule of law and respect the rights of every citizen. But not the ones who do not subscribe to such behavior. We do believe in and support preemptive strikes because they save lives. This is a logical conclusion because preemptive strikes save lives and prevent the further loss of lives. We are all about saving lives at this channel. We at the channel aid criminals with a passion and do not want them over here. We do not want your views. Your oh, things are as well? Yes, everything good, man. Can't complain. Complain, gotta take out my blessing, you know, you know what I'm saying? See, I do some hard work from the other day, so I don't even interrupt you. You're doing the work there. Mm. You can't get I do a lot, so I just love you. I just, I just <laughs> saw it go on them things there. But hey, but between me and you, you know, say some people for Angela Burke. But them, you, you understand? Well, I want to give her something about that to it. Yeah. Gee, Burke. Yeah. If you go up on any Google account and thing, Mm. and try to research about her. You notice them don't put up about her family name. Yeah, man, because... And even, mm. and even an autobiography them that say uh, family is later on, like them basically have nothing to enclose about her background and family mm. in Jamaica. They always make it seem like she was born overseas, raised overseas, and everything was overseas. But that a lie. No, me, 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 I tell you, me, no. But that mm. was what them put out there. That's how me know, sir. The political agenda where them a push out there, it was wrong. Mm. I'm a family, I wouldn't know the people them in about. It's but, sad. But you don't know, have to deny, you don't know, have to deny, you know what I'm saying? It's sad, man. Mm. Trust me. I want you witness it first and now, even the other day, you remember the incident, I think you was talking to this officer in that talk. You know, the, oh, that story was like two weeks ago that come out. Oh, you attack the one. You attack the brother where you walk with um, you know thing that you know um, Tony Brown. And I know all of them. Mm, yeah, man. And he basically said to yourself, make you remember, my remind, my experience something to yourself. Tony mm. Brown and Danai, they never had a deal in between 2004. Yeah, man. The war, the war. So yes, that that's that before you ever tell me and them thing that they tell me that. I remember me tell you, I never hear that interview there. Mm, that's a bit. <laughs> him tell me that before you tell me, you know. Yeah, that's yes, me me. So when me hear it, me I say, I see it, somebody can actually say it when mm. me that talk about. Because at, at 800, and, at the time, I you know it was somewhere in the 800 million region contract, 98. Mm. 
Uh, yeah, yeah, somebody somebody was close to Burke, um, to Paul Burke, confirm, confirm that what you tell me. So I don't you tell me. Somebody, somebody, um, cause he may not tell me if he contact all the woman and him. Uh, in, but in, in eight hours still doing it, cause he may call her and say she had three uh, uh, I'm telling you. I have another family name, I'm a here, but show you how him, the uh, helicopter JDF, them run up a operation pan, him a stadium and take him away, I pursue him there. Mm. Desi, them call him, so I get him full name. Oh, that's a, a, yes, that's a Tony Brown brother. Yeah. You know, say, mm-hmm. like, you know, say, uh, between, you know, say, um, somebody I tell me, say, one of Tony, Br- Tony Brown brother live up at PMP headquarters. I'm the same thing never alarm, man. Like, him the man, you know. Yes, them say him. The same, the same. You think I owe them like all them that say Jim Brown or the man? Yes. Devian Blake. How him name? How him name? Some him name started with some Z. Me never go back and all them thing there. No, a Desi. Yeah. Let me let me explain. As them say him. Oh, you tell me. Put a damn mother brother that. But me could I tell us I told him. The most basic name was Desi. We always have him as Desi, 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 Desi. You get me? Mm. Then if a Desi Brown, I still have separate father I search for. But I was still doing him go. And a JDF police cut a whole operation. Mm. Hold him. And when they hold him, I don't know what my papa didn't know him be a person said we mm. still that person. Mm. Big, 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 big man of the PMP thing too. Big, big man. Mm. I watch a thing and I'm just say, boy, bull be a center mass. A politics you funny thing. thing. You have funny thing about out of center mass. Every chosen I keep an event down there and I tell you, center mass different. Mm. <laughs> I like the center mass, so we know. True. I'll pop can and mash it up to one thing there, you know. I'm going to tell you that. Mm. All of them guys, eh? Uh, in a little music world, a whole heap of things happen. I'm to tell you. But then in the music world, the entertainment world, remember me? Show? So you understand where I come from? Mm. If I did. But they even have, I just, I just show enough things me have. But as I said the other day when I got called, it was like, I just asked me, I guess sometime, mm. I get my story them straight cars. I want to put a thing out there, but I still know I'm out myself. Because I know a lot. You yeah. get me? Mm, but the, so, but the, them, them will recognize your voice? Huh? Them will recognize your voice and them thing there? Eh? Definitely, alright. Mm. You see, the 90th story, mm. you can put that out there in a snippet. Mm. Oh, me that's me that put that no, because even my mom if you send her some picture of my family, them things. Yeah. Just to show you all them, to show you them did the, all them secretive, then put it at my uncle's work. Oh, remember you know, them have some brigadista training in the military, you know, the militant in the middle of them. As I say, I told me the young, 11 years old, 10, 9. Them mm. talk anything fluently around you, but as soon as them sister you have understanding, the talk is done. Mm. You understand? Mm. As soon as them sister boy here yeah, draw too close to the conversation, them know, you know. <clears throat> the conversation done. Because mm. enough of them. Because even see him Jackie Fish. You see me? Yeah. And they, me know him, you must know him, the man name in the days. Then can't vote you that the man name. Jackie mm. Fish. Mm. Okay. <laughs> I don't know what him they are doing at 98 between him death. Mm-hmm. But he might actually go up to Dana and box him and that'd be somewhere that's impossible. Mm. Impossible. Because if you ever said Dana I get boxed and off and I look as crap, I look at nobody. Yeah. But he wasn't a nobody in a 98, I'm telling you, because Dana I go to the extreme. Mm. At that funeral for sure we say, this man is a nobody and I get a gun salute. You're going to bury like a dog, mm. and you're not going to get nothing good. Because whatever you was portraying, because basically my uncle that brought you, he the newcomer, the young guns, mm. the Tony Brown, new youth. You get me? Yeah. So he come with 
different movements. Him come with a movement, where so, How would I put it? Say, so, a blood in a female heart. Mm. You get me? Him not a giant aside, because whatever might be Tony Brown that look a squash and reason with that knife from the whole politics thing, the younger gun not nah, a reason or nothing. Mm. So that is what my uncle come for sure. So listen, I'm not in the talking, you know. You get me? Mm. And then Tony Brown did as a strong man from the heart failure and diabetic situation. But uncle, everybody who used to live at Warwick, he laughed and shift up. So there's no... All right, but I don't say that was a history back then. It was a part of history, the Brown thing. Angela Brown broke, yeah, she in a politics, but she not, I don't think she had pushed no badness, because you know, yeah, she I eradicate the community or I get rid of people. But beyond that, then I'm the poorest person in the family again as a man. Mm. So the whole of that, the thing, empire, the mush up front, Tony Brown, then we can tell you that. The world. So me have our family you now, alright, me send out the story and it not got the right to it. I really want things out there to talk about the corruption, because as when me said, the corruption part, I not just say the police, you know. I know, I know what you say, man. But, the re- but the, overall, the reason I want to write my statement. Mm. Like, I can't forget when, yeah, yeah, testify. And you know, I tell the front man is lying, just because mm-hmm. the police are hurt. The police are I said it, yes, it's big now when they think I'm thinking about a random killing, but if I know this man is allied to the brown and this man and this man, he must be rotted. If me bust up that case, I mean, I don't know if you bust big case, I get like stripe going up. You get me? Because if I him, they get the case, I end up lock up Danai. When he find out, say, Danai. Yes, him, they get up around, but, but you were even saying in your report, so when police lock up people like them, they, they not get prayers. Mm, true. Like uh, the boy the vase from Long Portland, when he do foolishness and police bring him forward, it does look like a police do something wrong. So even listening to your program, I wonder if it even makes sense. But him that do at the time, I say, all right, he might bring down that night. No, what the fuck do Huh? Me before you, you know, me, me just, me, me still I do some background thing, on it and them thing. So me just, I make you know, say, I check out some of your things, man. It's factual, you understand? Just like what you did say on them things. And, and I don't know, I don't know, made, made up story, you understand? Yes, I mean, mm. I just like up to the bigger crime thing, just put up that thing. Yes. I'm ready on them things, you know, um, about the, um, what do you mean? About Tony Brown and the brother, them and them things. You understand? Yeah, but I don't feel bad. Mm. But just go on and take care of yourself, my brother, and all the best, yeah? I likewise, you, sir. All right, my yeah. boss, cool, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, in this remarkable journey, we introduce you to a man from a notorious family deeply entrenched in the criminal underworld and indulged, revered, lauded, and celebrated in the shadows because his family deeds carry a weight that haunts him. Surprisingly, he openly acknowledged their misdeeds, which have caused immeasurable arm to other families yeah so you know in his quest to end the rampant killing so you know he wants ease on a quest because he wants to see the end to the rampant killing plague in jamaica he understand that irrespective of our diverse background we all share a common desire to lead a peaceful to lead peaceful lives filled with hope love and aspiration Together, we can forge a path towards unity and collectivity. Strive to end the cycle of violence. So prepare to be enthralled as we unravel the complexities and contradictions that divine, define is this man's character. From his profound sense of belonging to the criminal underworld's pride to his unwavering determination to redeem himself and his family legacy. The steel promises to keep you on the edge of your seat. You understand? Yeah, so this man, you know, I'm just totally different. So, you know, so it's, it's a riveting tale of crime, pride and redemption. It's a compelling testament to the resilience of the human spirit. As we delve into the depths of the extraordinary story of Tony Brown background, we invite you to witness the stark reality behind the surface. 
a lot of the hidden secrets exposed and untold truths and discover the power of redemption. Because this man, him no want to continue to live in the shadows and them things. Although him no want himself known publicly, but him just a cheer what he knew as a youth growing up in a family and them things. And he's not ashamed of he's not ashamed of what they have done because it's done he, he cannot change history. But what he wants, he wants the cycle of killing in Jamaica to stop. So that's why he comes out and to even to publicly acknowledge that Angela Brownberg is his blood relative and I know how they are related and he told because you know when somebody know your mother and know say your mother live a Saint Thomas and this and that and one and two little things and your fa and your father and your mother and your uncle them and this and all of that and all them things you understand and then at a point then the police at name Tigo Brown yes who you know one of the uh, police officer who was very close to Tony Brown too and had a police officer out of East Kingston bad man yeah but hey yeah you know as we say you know youths yeah you know you can't change in a life still doing it. I just listen to, you know, um, although this man is involved in a crime, you can't change the, change your life. You don't have to indulge in a life with an illegal gun. Because you know how the NID, if you have an illegal gun, in my brother, I tell you this, you know, you know, say, it's either your friend or a killer, or a police, or you end up a prisoner. I just saw it go. I don't know how a man become a criminal, because to be a criminal, you have to be dishonest. You understand? So, yeah man, so you know, unlock the hidden secret, expose and expose the untold truths and discover the power of redemption. So you know, so as we you know, it's a captivating journey that tra transcends boundaries, res resonates with our deepest emotion and shed light on the path towards a better future. So if you haven't subscribed to the channel as yet, yes, consider subscribing. Subscribe now. Yeah, click the like button, click on the bell. Uh, whenever I release a video, you'd be the first one to receive it. Like the video. Yeah, man, like the video. Share the video. Comment below. And most importantly, join our Patreon team. Um, yes, we have something, we, you know, as we are with East Kingston, we are going to, we'll be releasing uh, former FBI. Yes, what was the FBI? This is African-American. I don't know, somebody this way. From our culture, we will lie and will tell and lie. We don't know how them survive and them thing there. You understand? When them, you understand? You're going to hear, yeah, an FBI agent um, who had investigated, arrested, and charged the gully man them from East Kingston. And yeah, and you're going to shock. Even Michael Manley, at one time in the 90s, former Prime Minister Michael Manley was under the radar of the FBI. They were investigating him, and the FBI agent came to Jamaica the embassy. You're going to hear that and them thing there. You understand? So have yourself a beautiful day. Jamaica, Young Police Channel. Out.